This solved exercise is about indexing and slicing of Pandas data frame. We will learn how to do indexing and slicing of our data frame. The first step as usual is to import the Pandas library as PD. Import the Titanic data set as per the URL given in your description box and save it as Titanic. We will use the read underscore csv function as this is a csv file and directly provide the URL in place of file path. So titanic equal to pd dot read underscore csv and provide the file path which in this case is the URL from the github. Print the information of titanic data frame. This function will provide multiple information to you like class, number of rows, number of columns, column index, name of column, missing values and data type. So by using titanic.info function, the class is data frame. There are 1309 rows with 14 columns. These are the index of column starting from 0 to 13, column label or column name, null values. So there are null values in age. There are null values in fair, cabin, embarked, boat, body, home destination. So wherever the number of non-null values are less than the number of rows, we can say that there are missing values. Then the data type like integer, object, float. Print the column labels only. Data frame dot columns will provide us the label or the name of all the column as index. So we here we can find all the labels of 14 columns. Out of those 14 columns in Titanic data frame, select the column with name. The name column has stored the names of the passenger. Titanic dot name. So simply by dot, we can extract any single column of our data frame. Just note that the type of Titanic dot name is not a data frame, but it is a pandas series. So series is a single column extracted from the pandas data frame. Select passenger name column as pandas series and save as name. So in previous, we have just extracted or viewed the series, but now save it as a name. So this is simple. We are assigning the extracted column with label name. Now you see that it is also the same as Panda series because it is a single column from the data frame and the shape that this column has 1309 rows as Select passenger name column and save as pandas data frame. So this time instead of selecting as a panda series, can we select a single column from a data frame as data frame? If you have observed in our previous example, we have used single square bracket to extract the column. Here as a hint, if we use double square bracket to extract a single or multiple column, then what will happen? We have again extracted a single column name and stored it as a name. Now we see that the view is also different. The difference in terms of the label. Now our extracted column has the label name. And if we look at the type, it is now a data frame. It is now a data frame. And the shape is not like previous. It has one column also. So it's a columnar in nature, a two dimension like a data frame, whereas series is a one dimension with only rows. Now select only specific hundred row and all columns with ilock function. ilock function uses index to extract rows and column. So our data frame dot ilock and within square bracket, we have to first mention the rows comma the column 
we want hundredth row to be extracted and all column. So Titanic, the name of data frame, dot I lock. Within square bracket, we first mention the row, hundredth row, comma. For all column, we use column. So we'll be able to extract the information about a passenger in hundredth row of our Titanic data frame. The passenger name you can see is Gordon, male with age 49 and so on. Select hundredth row with lock function. So this time we are using dot lock function, which require the labels instead of index. So data frame dot lock square bracket the information about rows or label of rows comma column so you have seen that here in dot i lock and lock functions we have used 100 as row index also and row label because our data frame rows don't have specific label for row index whereas in column we have column index and column label both as we have seen in dot info function so titanic dot lock hundred row comma all columns the same we will be able to extract of information about mr gordon select all rows with column label name and fear so two columns we need to extract this time with i lock function so rows are all from our data frame but the columns are only two name of passenger and the fare paid by the passenger using i lock function the syntax remains same data frame dot i lock bracket rows comma column so in previous we have used for all column column so i think in this rows place we will use the column so as a solution titanic dot i lock we want all rows so we use a column comma we need to specify the index of our column name and fare not their label so you can see the index of any column from dot info function so the index of name column is 2 index of fare column is 8 so we use titanic dot i lock all rows comma second index and eighth index column select all rows with lock function and column label name and fare so as in previous but this time we have to use dot lock function which require label to be mentioned titanic dot lock for all rows we use colon and instead of 2 and 8 as index dot lock function require label or the name so we specify the name of the column as name comma fair so this will extract the same information which we have extracted in our previous example with dot i lock function select row number 50th 25th 15th and column label passenger class fare age with both lock and i lock function so you have noticed that the sequence of rows are not in ascending order and the label passenger class fare age are also not in sequence as per original data frame so with dot lock we need data frame dot lock and in place of rows we provide 50th row 25th row and 50th row and dot lock we provide the label as passenger class fare and age so we'll be able to extract specific information of passenger in row index 50th 25th and 15th of their traveling passenger class the fare they paid and the age and have you observed that in 15th passenger we don't have age information or the information about the age is missing and an the same with dot i lock require to be mentioned as index so titanic dot i lock 50th 25th and 15th row and column index 0 8 and 4th so you can very well observe that it need not necessary that you extract the column in the same sequence as in original data frame you can extract the information or column as per your requirement 
select rows from 10th to 25th it's not 10th and 25th but 10th to 25th and column label passenger class fare age with both lock and i lock function so we need all rows between 10th and 25th to be extracted including 10th and 25th with dot lock which consider rows label and column label so we specify titanic dot lock 10th row start and end at 25th column passenger class fare and age so when we have to extract only 10th and 25th we put within bracket 10 comma 25th if we have to extract from start to end then we use 10 column 25th so row information and the column x information when we are extracting using dot i lock function so one point to remember that while using i lock function or as a index the and is not included we have seen that in dot lock function we have used or mentioned the rows as 10 to 25th but here we have to mention starting the same 10th but ending at 26th because 26th is not included in i lock function so this you have to remember if we put 25th here then it will only extract the rows from 10 to 24 one less than the, the end point or and is not included so titanic dot i lock 10th to 26th as 26th is not included it will extract only up to 25th and column index 0 8 and 4 so we see that 10 till 25th has been extracted 26th row is not included or and is not included in i lock function select rows from 10th to 15th and columns from passenger class to age with both lock and i lock function so this time we have to extract the rows ranging from 10 to 15th and also the column ranging from passenger class to age with both lock and i lock function with titanic dot lock function the rows 10 to 15th and passenger class to age column but the similar with i lock function the rows 10 to 16th why 16th because and is not included similarly for column 0 to 5 why 0 to 5 because 5 is not included so what is 0 index column passenger class the one index column survived name 2 sex 3 age 4 so you see that the same applies to rows and column in i lock function that and is not included here 16th index row is not in included and here fifth index column is not included select all passenger with age equal to and more than 35 years now it is condition we want to extract all the passenger information from our titanic data frame but with age more than 35 years so we will first have to mention the condition we say that on titanic age column age to be greater than equal to 35 and with this condition extract from the original titanic data frame see in age column so wherever the age is either equal to 35 or greater than the 35 th those rows have been extracted now you can save this data frame based upon this condition for further analysis and use so there are 345 rows or 345 such passengers traveling in titanic having age greater than equal to 35 select all passengers with age equal to and more than 35 years and column with label passenger class to age now we want the rows or the passengers traveling in titanic with age equal to or greater than 35 but instead of extracting all the column of our titanic data frame we want specific column from passenger class to age we'll use dot lock function here 
Titanic dot lock. So we, for rows place, we will mention the condition comma the column we required. So what is the condition to extract the row or passenger that his or her age to be greater than equal to thirty five. So Titanic age column greater than equal to thirty five. Don't forget to enclose the conditions within round bracket comma. We want column to be extracted from passenger class to age. So you will see that here you will have all the passengers with age more than 35 or equal to 35, but the column only passenger class till age. So instead of extracting all the passengers, we want only female passenger with age equal to 35 or more than 35. So you see two conditions we are applying for extracting the passenger, the gender and the age. We again use dot lock function to specify the rows, comma, column. So now in row space, we have two conditions. So the first condition on age column greater than or equal to 35 and on gender or sex column equal to equal to female. So this condition we mentioned here and we extracted all the columns. So all females with age greater than or equal to 35. There are 125 female passengers traveling in Titanic with age equal to greater than 35. So hope you have understood how you can extract the columns, rows based upon their index, their label or conditions. This is very well used in any data science or further analysis and this skill is very much required for exploratory data analysis also. So if you have any doubt then write in the comment box or you can join our live online doubt sessions to clarify your doubts with faculty.